welcome you welcome here if you are new here you are welcome to my youtube channel if you are old member here too you are welcome it's great to have you all here i'm samuel also and please kindly subscribe to my youtube channel turn on the post notification bell and then like comment and share in this particular tutorial video i'm going to design a very beautiful and simple social media flyer so let me open my puzzle app up all right so this is the design we are going to design this thank god it's friday flyer very beautiful one you see it's very on point yeah tomorrow happens to be um friday so you have to practice then you post it on your social media handles or status for people to know that you are a designer you are you getting it here yeah, so without wasting my time let's go in let's start afresh let me tap here let me tap here when you tap here this is the home page of the pizzlap app for those the beginners here is this is the home page of the pizzlap app this is the interface of it then you tap here tap on the eighth side then we delete this default test here we delete it we delete it right you see delay there yeah then you come here we are going to upload our background we are going to upload our background. so we tap here always when you want to upload background tap here right so let's come to gallery when you tap there then you come to from gallery from gallery from gallery then you select this background let me come here let me come to here yeah this is the background we are going to use you see yeah so i'll give it to you then you select this particular background you tap on the check mark here right so we are going to upload our image we are going to upload our image so when you are want to upload out your image come to this middle tool here you see this middle tool here tap on it then you come to import so we are going to import the image from our gallery please graphic design is something you have to take your time especially when you are designing when you are newbie i will advise you to take your time so we will upload this particular image here this cartoon image very beautiful high quality image so we tap on this check mark here then we position it here we reduce the size a bit we position it here as you can see position it here right very nice one very nice one okay then let's come to you come to okay let's make it like this let's come to relative position you see the relative position you position it in the center tap here position in the center follow attentively then you tap on the check mark here then it will send you here now once you are done tap here this layer button yeah this layer button so you tap there then you tap on this padlock you lock it i have used it then you lock it right after you lock it then we will write the test the thank god is friday so anytime you want to write test come to the a sign here come to a sign here to come to test you edit it right you edit the test let's write thank god it's friday thank god it's friday okay then increase the size a bit then you come to fonts come here you will see font this a b this um alphabet there the font yeah so you tap on font so you are on your font so let's choose this font let's choose this font this chunk five this chunk five i don't know if i've mentioned it well that's the font let's tap on it right so you see it has affected it here so that's the font tap on okay so we have the font here like this the font here like this so let's go and see the size of it if you have to use somewhere 120 so it is 126 so reduce the size to 120 you see yeah so tap on the check mark here then let's position it in the center no in the middle yeah so we tap on relative position then we tap in the middle here's the middle right we tap in the middle it's even in the middle right so now let's copy the same test copy the same test tap on copy you see copy here you tap on copy right so you come to color we are going to give it transparent we are going to make it transparent so you tap on color when you tap on color this is the transparent color you see this i can tap on it but let me show you how i did it tap on the plus sign here tap on the plus sign here when you tap on the plus sign here move this test slider you see 
this transparent area move the slider to the transparent point the end the another point you see so it will say i moved i slide it here right so tap on ok so now we have the transparent you see there's no color for it yeah that's the transparent so now come to relative position and position the center you have to make it align with this thing so always position it in the center tap here to position the center now tap on the check mark you can you can't see anything but so we want it to be legible so we are going to give it a stroke so come to stroke you see stroke here where is it stroke 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 you see stroke here yeah tap on stroke enable it then reduce the stroke the stroke weight reduce it to three somewhere three okay and change the color to white see so we have this like this the stroke like this now let's reduce the opacity let's reduce the opacity of it so you can see opacity here right take your time and know the tools then you work on it graphic design when you are designing it takes time so reduce the opacity to 70 don't rush when you are designing yeah so you read reduce the opacity to 70 then you position it down a bit come to position position it here right so position it here position it here yes okay you see the space between them yeah that's it so let's copy the, the same test let's copy it copy and bring it this one also here if you send it to back it is in the front of the image you want it to go to the back of the image so come to here to back so it is to back so tap on to back it is in the back right so let's position it okay okay position it here let the space between this one the first one the second one be the same space between the second one and the third one as you can see then let's change the color of it we are not using the white for this one let's come to no let's come to stroke let's come to stroke come to stroke then change the color of the stroke we are using this yellow this yellow here you see this yellow here this yellow here right so this is it we are done with the test so now we are i want to upload some image i have some image in my gallery to beautify the design so i come to this middle here as i told you always come here when you want to upload image from your gallery so come to import right come to import so let's come to here yeah so we are going to implore upload this particular image here the love image right so make it look more attractive and beautiful so rotate it reduce the size a bit and rotate it here right reduce the size a bit let me see the size the relative size yeah okay 50 54 54 you see then position it here okay take your time position it here right so let's reduce the opacity of it a bit to maybe 90 or 80 90 90 right so let's copy it again let's copy it again position it here this time reduce the size a bit let it be a bit smaller than the first one then position it here and reduce the size the reduce opacity sorry reduce the opacity to 60 it's okay reduce the opacity to 60 then copy it again copy it again then position it here rotate it a bit see tap here to rotate it yeah so position it here increase the size a bit then position it here as you can see we are almost done we are done so this is the design i want you to um copy then um uh, follow the steps and do it but that but then let's write some uh, friday wishes code there so come to test tap on test edit right so let's write something let's write any um friday wishes because uh here's my you can write anything but here's mine yeah so we write just wanted to to say to say it's just wanted to say it is a great it's a great day you know 
to stay cool stay cool stay cool enjoy the weekend yeah just wanted hey just wanted to say it is a great day stay cool enjoy the weekend all right so something like this then let's reduce the size let's reduce the size you can tap here this end then compress it like this to reduce the size but then you can come to size two then you reduce the size let's leave it somewhere 20 then tap here tap here to compress we want it to be three lines right something like this right position it here you can use this same font for it it's not bad right so guys that's it that's the design take your time and follow everything attentively then practice see you guys so tap here when you want to save your work tap here then you tap on save as image you can save it as project if you don't if you want to save it in the Pizzlap app, save it as project, right? You, if any tap on save as project, here is it. You save it as project. You name it. Maybe thank God it's Friday. You can use any word. Thank God I have saved it before, so I will use the red. Thank God it's Friday three. Then I will save it, right? If I want to save it as image to I'll tap on save as image. It's advisable to save it as image then save it as uh, distant. So that you cannot you will not lose it when you want to make, do some manipulations on the design so if you tap on let me come back if you tap on save as image then you tap here you tap on the dimension on the dimension default then you tap on this arrow here then choose ultra the last one choose ultra then save to gallery right it will save to your gallery so you wait for it to save to your gallery so that's it guys take your time then design and come out with a nice design like this so you can come to your gallery to check if it is saved right if it is saved so it is saved here guys that's it thank you all for following practice then if possible submit your assignment to me thank you guys